Peter, do you love me? Go and feed my sheep. Peter, do you love me? Take care of the weak. Peter, do you love me? Stand up and be strong. Now I have to go away, but I'll not leave you alone. When they took the Lord from the garden, Peter followed them. Someone recognized him and said, there's one of them. Peter, he denied him three times in a row. But his heart was broken when he heard the old cock crow. Peter, do you love me? Go and feed my sheep. Peter, do you love me? Take care of the weak. Peter, do you love me? Stand up and be strong. Now I have to go away, but I'll not leave you alone. But on the day of Pentecost, the Comforter arrived. He came in like a rushing wind, the cloven tongues of fire. Peter stood up and began to preach to them the Holy Word. And after 3,000 souls were saved, these words you might have heard. Peter, do you love me? Go and feed my sheep. Peter, do you love me? Take care of the weak. Peter, do you love me? Stand up and be strong. Now I have to go away, but I'll not leave you alone. Will Peter grow stronger in the faith? and preached throughout the land. He walked and talked and prayed to God, obeying his command. And then they crucified him, they nailed him upside down. And these words you might have heard as the hammer rang out loud. Lord, you know I love you, I've tried to feed your sheep. Lord, you know I love you, I took care of the weak. Lord, you know I love you, I've tried to be so strong. Thank you, Lord, for loving me, now I'm ready to go home.